Hemophilia A is an inherited bleeding disorder caused by a deficiency in factor VIII activity. The current standard of care includes prophylactic intravenous factor VIII infusions. However, these infusions may result in the development of anti-factor VIII antibodies that can inhibit efficacy and increase morbidity. Intravenous bypassing agents such as activated factor VII and activated prothrombin complex may be required to counteract these effects. Emicizumab is a recombinant humanized bispecific monoclonal antibody that binds to activated factor IX and factor X, brings them into proximity, and restores the scaffolding function of the missing activated factor VIII. In the Phase III International Open Label HAVEN study, investigators randomized in a 2 to 1 ratio 53 participants with hemophilia A of any severity who had documented high factor VIII inhibitor levels and episodic treatment with bypassing agents to receive weekly subcutaneous emicizumab prophylaxis or no prophylaxis. An additional 56 participants who had a history of prophylactic use of bypassing agents or who were not able to enroll in other study groups were assigned to treatment with emicizumab. The primary endpoint was the reduction in annualized bleeding rates after 24 weeks of treatment. Emicizumab prophylaxis resulted in a statistically significant decrease in the annualized bleeding rate to 2.9 as compared with 23.3 in the no prophylaxis group, which represented a decrease of 87%. In addition, 63% of the participants randomized to emicizumab prophylaxis had no bleeding. Thrombotic microangiopathy and thrombosis were serious adverse events reported in four participants receiving both emicizumab and activated prothrombin complex concentrate, but these effects resolved after cessation of the bypassing agent. The authors conclude that emicizumab prophylaxis prevented or substantially reduced episodes of bleeding in patients with hemophilia A with inhibitors. Full trial results are available at NEJM.org.